That sounds badass. Uh, we're doing it. Another chair, another gaming chair. We're gonna unbox this thing. This is the Mavix M9 gaming chair, a 999 US dollar price chair. And based on the past chair videos we've done, you guys seem to enjoy the expensive, the, the fine, the, the, the fine things in, in chairs. What do we have here? I guess the first thing to figure out is how should we be unboxing this? I don't see any instructions, just comes in a plain box. That's fine, no big deal. We don't need a big fancy show. Maybe this is how you're saving like $500. So far the packaging is definitely a little bit worse than the past two chairs that I've opened up. The Razer Isker and the Logitech Herman Miller Embody gaming chair. But, Let's see what we got, what kind of goodies we got here. Mavics M Wheels, enhanced gaming experience. I don't know if there's a good method to getting the top of the chair out. No, this definitely, what the heck? Typically when the boxes have like the pull off thing, they actually tell you that. So unless I'm missing something, it doesn't explicitly tell me that. So you know what? I'm gonna blame instructions on that one. I'll tell you right now, this thing pops. So the fact that it comes completely assembled, it's pretty cool. So that was a pretty subpar unboxing experience, but at least it came completely assembled, so you don't have to mess around with that. I know the Razor chair we had to partially put together. The uh, Herman Miller Logitech Embody chair just kind of rolled right out of the box, which is really nice. Keep in mind though, that's an extra like $500 up on this chair. Wow, so I'm actually not gonna lie, based on their website and just the way that the design elements are on the site, this thing looks way cooler in person than it does on the site. And I'm not just saying that. And also this material on the backrest here is, this is nice. I need other people to validate the feelings that I'm feeling right now. So at this point, some of you guys might be wondering who is Mavix? And honestly, I said the exact same thing. So. I went over to their website. I got a little bit of a marketing speak from who they are and what they're trying to do here. So let me just read it right off their site. Mavix is developed by a partnership combining a team with over 20 years of experience designing ergonomic office chairs and a group of endemic gamers. Mavix has carefully crafted an ergonomic gaming solution that breaks the mold of previous gaming chairs. So the next thing we need to do is sit in this bad boy right after a word from our sponsor. Thanks to Vessi for sponsoring today's Short Circuit. I'm actually wearing their shoes right now. I didn't even know they were sponsoring today's video. That's sick. Vessi footwear is known for being waterproof, lightweight, and comfortable. The shoes won't trap heat or air with the Dynamax material. It'll keep your feet cool in the summer and warm in the winter. Lots of us here at LMG wear them all the time, like myself. So keep your feet dry by using code Short Circuit for $25 off at Vessi.com forward slash Short Circuit down below. All right, we're gonna take a seat. We're gonna see how this thing feels. Does it feel as nice as it looks? Yeah, it does. It feels nice. This thing's sick. And actually, it is very, very smooth. Even the reclining in its base form, I haven't touched anything, messed with anything. It is nice. It's not too touchy. It's not too, you know, rigid. It's not giving me a lot of pressure back, but it is supporting my lower back, which is nice. And I'm sitting quite terribly, to be completely honest. I'm not sure how well the white color will hold up over time with like, you know, you get your Mountain Dew and your Dorito chip dust on it and stuff like that. But man, this thing feels nice. This is by far the comfiest chair that I've sat in from my first experience, my first impressions out of any of the chairs that I've looked at so far on this channel. So that's, that's cool. I wonder how it holds up with uh, gaming. But first, we should probably go over all the features that the chair has, so let's do that. So we're gonna go ahead and go through Mavix's future nine functions. So the first being, of course, like many other gaming chairs, the headrest tilts, tilt down, tilt up. Actually, interesting. I mean, sure, you know, why not? <laughs> Supposed to make that noise? That sounds badass. Uh, that's pretty neat. So tall people can enjoy it and short people can enjoy it. That's fantastic. A chair for everyone. Maybe not everybody, but it's more than a few people. So next step is gonna be the infinite locking position recline feature, which I need to find again. Oh, is that this thing? No, is it over here? 
No, maybe. It's this. Nope. I didn't find the tilt thing, but I did find the ability to be able to move the seat forward and backward, which is pretty fancy. Shimmy, shimmy, woo! That's fun. It's pretty cool. What? So what did you do? You pull it up? Ah! What the? Uh. Oh, I feel like I'm gonna fall over. This doesn't feel safe. Again, very smooth, very comfortable. My lower back is still being supported, which is cool. Uh, the lumbar support system isn't quite in the right spot yet, but okay. I feel like I'm gonna fall over, but that's sturdy. All right, so next up is their four-dimensional armrests. So this is actually a little spooky, but that's okay. Feels kind of wrong to be doing that, but I think it's fine. Or I'm just like absolutely destroying the chair right now. Doesn't feel super natural. But, uh, sure. <laughs> Anyways, you can also go up and go down. Classic, of course. And can you move these forward and back? Interesting. Okay. So I'm sure you guys have seen other gaming chairs where you can move the armrest forward and backward. It's a small chance that I'm doing it wrong, but hopefully not. It is cool that you can just... And you don't have to press any buttons or whatever. You just, if you want to change your armrest position, you're gaming... You want it straight ahead, game. So then the last main thing that we're gonna check out is their dynamic variable lumpar support system. This is what Mavix is calling an advanced tensile recovery fabric. This is why when I first sat on this chair, it was super comfortable because this automatically adjusted to the way I was sitting rather than needing me to adjust it to me. So that's pretty cool. Boop, boop, boop. So the last thing that I haven't done, I haven't done a true caster test with these original casters that are on the thing. You know, it's, it's nice. They're not the smoothest casters, but um, I mean, they're hefty. Gamers got to play a gamer game in a gamer chair. Game game. Man, I think I could sleep in this thing. Right now, because the chair is so smooth, I'm like naturally kind of all over the place. All right, so the only thing that's left is to get some other people to come in and give their thoughts. Get the gamer style going. So do you like the tilt? Do you leave your chairs like locked when you're gaming or do you have them tilt? So my chair at home, uh, the whole thing is kind of just one piece. Mm -hmm. So it all tilts back. Uh, this one's actually pretty nice, I'm realizing, because only the back seems to tilt and your the, the bottom part where your butt is stays the same. When I'm at my desk, I'm usually holding a controller, and I know I'm gonna get a little bit of smack for that, but <laughs> I'm usually holding a controller, so I want it to be angled in, and I want my arms to just fall like this. I think it's, it's comfortable. It's pretty good, right? So, yeah. yeah so. I mean, I'd rather have a seat that's too wide than too oh, tiny. Oh, one up? 800%, yeah, fantastic. Are you, uh, do you wanna buy this chair for $1,000? Mm, uh. Ergonomic support, and then actually a really comfortable chair. I will, potentially maybe possibly buy one of these or I'll just take this one which I'm actually probably just gonna do so thank you guys very much for watching make sure to like the video comment get subscribed and uh, we'll see you on the next one or other people will because I'm gone because I'm taking this chair bye bye Woo!